Well, main priority was structural soundness. I, I think that's what a judge does. Is you try to find the cattle that are made right, and has some muscle expression. We are judging beef cattle, so they need to have some muscle expression. And of course, in the Red Angus show today, we also had EPDs. And uh, it was a little bit of a struggle today to find the ones that were phenotypically the right ones that had good enough numbers. But So I tried to use those as well as the phenotype, and that was my priority. Well, the Red Angus breed has gotten much more popular through the central part of the United States, and a lot of cattle are in that part of the world. And I think initially it was crossing them back on uh, Semitol cattle or maybe uh, highly uh, oh, French bred type cattle that were more muscular. And I think you've seen that in Canada as well. So the Red Angus breed has gotten much more popular now as those cows have turned more Red Angus into the purebred industry or commercial industry. I, I think you're even going to see them used maybe more on English crosses, even on Herefords and Angus. Well, actually, the, the honor of being asked is uh, whenever you get to judge in Denver, I doubt very many people turn it down. And um, that that's an honor. And, and I've judged here many times, but uh, if they ask, I'll come. Well, I think the biggest or the, the, the best aspect is your integrity. I, I think people ask you to come and judge, and if you've done much of it, that's why you're asked to do it. Uh, they feel like you're given your opinion, and, and that's, that's probably the secret to why I've judged for as long as I have. Uh, I just try to do what I like, and if I'm the only one that has to really be happy when it's over. Well, actually, that's in a nutshell the, the type of cattle that I like to judge are the ones we're trying to produce. Not necessarily are we always trying to pick the biggest and stoutest one at our place because we also sell commercial cattle and they've got to fit that industry. So we want them to be sound, we want them to be fertile, we want them to have a very neat look, we want them to have a great EPD profile, and now with the advent of DNA we want that as well. So if you get out on the edge with maybe too extreme, maybe too much muscle, too stout, you run into calving problems and things that we don't want. So that's kind of the way I judge as well. The kind of cattle we use are the ones we, I like to use in the show ring as well.